MediaTek has just announced the newest Beast processor it has. It is the Dimensity 9400. With this processor, MediaTek has beaten Snapdragon to be the first processor in the Android world to be manufactured in a 3 nanometer process. It is a completely advanced processor that could definitely completely change the perspective that many have of MediaTek, which started out releasing ultra simple processors for low end devices such as what is now Unisoc. But, in the middle of 2024, MediaTek has gone from strength to strength. This processor really will be a serious competitor for the high end. The single core improvement is 35% over the last generation, and the multi-core improvement is 28. In addition, this processor incorporates very high neural network processing capabilities locally to be able to run various artificial intelligence functions on devices without the need to connect to the cloud, such as generative artificial intelligence and even video generation directly on the device. In addition, it is obviously a processor that supports ray tracing, integrating GPU. Let's prepare the voice. Immortalis G925. This GPU is really scary because they say it's 41% more powerful than last generation. That's with respect to ray tracing and 40% more powerful in everything else. MediaTek has developed Hyper Engine technology for the gaming engine to ensure smooth gameplay with good stability. In addition, MediaTek claims that they have very efficiently optimized this processor to achieve a very smooth response time in conjunction with Android. In addition, the processor will support LPDDR5, X10, 6, 6, 6, 7 RAM, which is supposed to be the fastest standard currently supported in a smartphone. Now the detail is to know if manufacturers who will adopt this processor will also put this level of RAM. This processor will also provide the devices with tremendous capabilities in their cameras as for example it would allow HDR recording in any zoom range being the first processor to have this feature and supports video recording in 8K at 60 frames per second which will make recording in 4K at 60 frames per second more efficient as they assure that it can record in this resolution for 3 hours straight without any problems. It will also support up to 6 microphones recording 24-bit audio and of course supports Wi-Fi 7 and Bluetooth 5.4. As you know, the capabilities of this processor could be taken advantage of by manufacturers who decide to implement it, but it will be up to them whether they want to take advantage of the processor's capabilities to the limit or will settle for little. Samsung